Hello, I'm Lyndon Collard. This is Live Rock Critic 6. Tina Fey hosted Saturday Night Live with Ellie Goulding April 7th, 2011. Ellie Goulding has a very sweet voice but with a limited range. Her first song, Lights, moves right along, propelled by her unidentified bassist with a music man bass, a drummer and a keyboard. The first hint of OO oh, oh came as lights sped into the exciting part and I became aware of a background vocal. I looked all over and I began to think that the background vocal was Ellie again. The use of sequencers is generally legitimate, but there is a band on stage and I definitely hear too much music and the vocal continues when Ellie is not singing along with herself. It seems as if she has actually lost her place in the sequence for this to occur. At the end of the first song, the bobbling track, bink bonk, bink bonk, bink bonk, keeps going on after everything else stops. The keyboard player is not moving. This could be deliberate, but the overrun on the sequencer track is of the same length as the overrun on the background vocal in Ellie's voice. I danced to lights, as I did have to listen to it about eight times. It was a good dance. I guess this is the purpose of pop. I had viewed and listened to the second tune first, an Elton John song. This is your song, which Ellie performed with two live backup singers, a piano and strings. In a similar manner to Grace from the Nocturnals, problems with the ooh, 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 which I found lacked relevance and I was struck by the disparity with the lyrics. Somehow, I do not get it. As I write, I hear only, and I hear schmaltz. Similarly with Lady Gaga, who I will review next. My schmaltz alarms are going off. Am I missing some cachet? Is there something about those stereotypical TV female vocals from the 50s that is really cool that I'm not aware of? As I tried to research the names of band members, I ran into a review with the lyrics to Lights. I think those lyrics are absolute garbage. I wonder why they were featured. I wonder if I'm being too harsh. Ellie looks really nice, but whoever dressed her is no genius as the review I noticed suggested. I thought she looked bulgy in the middle and moved in somewhat of a wooden manner. Once again researching, all kinds of awards. I'm shocked. Is schmaltzy, wooden, and ordinary okay everywhere, not just on Saturday Night Live?